Two complete strangers are now sharing a forever bond by a kidney donation. Both men from New York met for the first time today. And News Channel 9's Ashley Cavaro shares their miracle journey from Upstate Medical University. Two men, a perfect match, and one miracle. I got a call, and they say, we have an altruistic donor that matches. And, um, and it was a really good kidney. A call Blaine Shrewsbury had been waiting years for, not knowing his one-of-a-kind match was miles away in Brockport, New York, whose kidney was originally supposed to go to a firefighter. Oh, he was a fellow firefighter that, that uh, needed a kidney, and, and I was going to donate it to him. But that, that didn't work out. But that was somebody else. That's somebody else being Blaine. I got the donation. It gave me, he, he, it was up to him to decide when we were going to do it. About three weeks later, on March 28th, he was given a new lease on life. The kidney worked right away, and Blake went home in a couple days, and now he's three months after, after transplant, doing very well, actually looking to go back to his old job. But finding a perfect match isn't so easy. Just alone here in central New York, nearly 400 people are waiting for a kidney transplant. And that list continues to grow each day. And that's why we want to get this message out there that more and more people should consider to, to be a living donor to help people. Like Blaine and Paul, who are now forever connected. In Syracuse, Ashley Gaffaro, News Channel 9. More than 7,000 people in New York State need a kidney transplant. Altogether, there's 100,000 people in the U.S. who are in need of one. Still ahead, right here on News Channel 9, sharing your results this year's